Good morning, I'm Craig Walters. I'm uh, the person who painted Friends. The uh, painting is a picture of my son and my dog who uh, have met uh, only recently as my son lives in Chicago. Um, this is where I paint, it's on my veranda. It's a painting in the background that I'm doing at the moment. And that's our, that's our outlook. This is where we live and uh, as actually the painting was on the set on the veranda of this, our, our house, and our dog is around here somewhere. Oh, there she is. Say hello, Andy. The painting I did was the second easel painting I've ever done. Um, prior to that, I've done a few murals. Uh, this one behind me is on a, a sea container at our farm, which I kind of like. And, um, so easel painting was a different thing altogether. I only started painting a couple of years ago uh, because there was a project in town run by a lady called Tracy Lee as painting power poles. And uh, I thought I'd have a go. And uh, fortunately enough, Tracy gave me a pole and I painted it and it seemed to go all right. So after that, I put a project together at the Captain Creek Community Club. Uh, we put a whole lot of poles in the ground and got local artists to paint them. And I'll give you a tour. This next one was done by Carmen Rosner and um, it's of honey eaters and it's, a, it's an absolute beauty. Next one was put together by the homeschoolers and Dan. So they put bottle tops on for the body and Dan and the kids, uh, well Dan sculptured the top and kids put the tops on and it looks great. The snake. This one was done by Madison and she came out, she's got a pet lizard, and um, so she's painted a lizard on there. <laughs> it looks great, it looks really 3D. I really like that one. Uh, this next one, well, I had a crack at this one. It's uh, it's mouths and whatever. And uh, it was a bit of a knot in the wood, so I made an owl in there, and uh, I helped down a bit with the sculpture on the, of the owl on the top. And, this next one was done by Jody Keyworthy and uh, it's obviously a tawny frog mouth and it's a pretty knotted old pole and she did a brilliant job and I think she did that in in two sessions so she's a very good artist. In terms of technique um, I've never had any training so I just um, you know mix paint until I like a colour and then I use it. Uh, I've got a habit of um, using uh, all the paint I've got until I've, I've uh, used it all up because I don't like wasting it. And um, sometimes when I'm painting, I just use the one brush for the whole thing. Um, here's a painting of a dead tree behind us. Well, it's actually a dead tree we're painted on. Uh, <laughs> we, we cut it down because it, uh, it, was, it was dead, but um, it was such a nice tree that we um, planted in the ground in a few places. So that's one. It matches the trees on the um, sea container. And then uh, here's another part of that tree which I've put metal posts on and I'm going to convert into a shade house.